entrepreneur, the investor, to assure uh, that uh, the state, in its continuity, uh, okay, is the bridge between uh, uh, one outgoing government and one incoming government, honor the commitments uh, uh, that uh, different governments undertake, different uh, private enterprises undertake within our uh, uh, legal, constitutional and business uh, environment. And this is only to assure that uh, uh, in spite of the fact that we are young country, 20 years, uh, we know that uh, there has to be stability, predictability, and trust, project initiated by a government uh, continue with the next and its conclusion. We have had this experience with the Tibet Corp, the first PPP uh, entered into uh, Timor-Leste with the previous government uh, and then concluded with this outgoing uh, government. from Indonesia, kawan dari Indonesia, selamat, selamat datang di Dili. Uh, uh, we want to continue to expand, uh, deepen the relationship in every field, not only diplomatic, uh, but uh, in business, uh, in investment, in uh, uh, every area possible. Uh, and for this, uh, private sector, it is more less than vital, very important. Governments can only build the legal framework, create the proper good business environment, uh, facilitate, streamline uh, processes, uh, streamline bureaucracy, etc. Probably, I hope, one of the priorities of the next government is to at least uh, two things immediate. One is to uh, make a blank decision about to eliminating anything to do with double taxation. Uh, that it should be uh, our national parliament should uh, pass uh, legal authorization uh, to the government so that the issues that are not uh, fall within uh, the constitution itself like a law uh, to facilitate business, it should be by executive order of the government. So that, because sometimes some of the simplest uh, things get buried in the, in the parliament, like issues of double taxation, investment protection, uh, and uh, so on. So these are the challenges and opportunities as we join ASEAN. What a country need, the country need cheap electricity, modern electricity. Uh, what a country need, it needs connectivity. Uh, it's amazing how we have uh, moved the last 20 years from all technologies uh, to uh, digitalization. And maybe five years from now, it will be completely dominated by artificial intelligence. And uh, it's amazing how <laughs> history move so fast from the very first industrial revolution it took many many decades to move to the second and the third to fourth industrial revolution only a matter of 20 years and uh, what else is going to happen uh, so uh, who knows 20 years from now five years from now the technology you are starting it will be obsolete and uh, uh, <laughs> So that shows how fast technology uh, evolved. And people less has a chance, a chance with you, the private sector, with your ingenuity, your risk-taking, your imagination about opportunity. People less they can uh, join the rest of ASEAN in uh, 21st century technology. Uh, it, uh, the, today you heard uh, Three speakers, uh, one, two outgoing ministers, one incoming minister, and, and, uh, and uh, so uh, 
it shows we are the same the same table, uh, and uh, there was a lot of acrimonious debate uh, two months ago, two months ago. Uh, but uh, that's democracy, and that's uh, we go now to the next season. The next season is governing. And, uh, so uh, uh, once again, uh, Dr. Abilio and uh, PLN uh, company from Indonesia. We very welcome to Timor Leste and thank you for trusting uh, Timor Leste investing in this very, very important uh, uh, connectivity and the uh, Minister of Transportation and the uh, Communications that was I hassled him a few times, always politely calling him. <laughs> I didn't understand much what was going on, but uh, I uh, always tried to do my best to, uh, to facilitate people who are trying to uh, do good for the country, do good for themselves, because obviously the telecom said that uh, the SACOM and the uh, PNL is not, uh, the, not Mother Teresa, not charity, not foundation, not business. Uh, and, uh, uh, but uh, uh, in being here, you are doing a great service to the economy of the country, to the people. Thank you uh, once again, terima kasih.